Ashley on Hell's Kitchen. Get the fuck out of here! Bitter enemies Jackie and Kristen went to war. Put your hands on me. Get the fuck out of my face! Put your hands on me. I don't know what garbage can that you got dragged out of, but what the fuck is wrong with you? Crazy, deranged. In their next challenge, the chefs were instructed to get creative with breakfast. I'm gonna do some fish tacos with like a fried quail egg. Chad's scallop tacos failed to impress. Disappointing. And even a perfect score from Ashley's French toast bread pudding. Thank you. Good job, Ash. Couldn't save the red team. The execution wasn't there. And it was Frank's take on steak and eggs. Steaks cooked properly. Steaks were cooked just the way I like them. Thank you so much. And secured the win for the blue team. Blue team, well done. At a special brunch service for local chefs and their families. He's gonna freak out about that breading. The red team struggled as Jackie had issues with fried chicken. Just shut the fuck up. I'm trying to help you. And Chad failed unbelievably with French toast. Bon appetit. Now fuck off. Things were even worse in the blue kitchen. How long do you need, Frank? Most of which was caused by a lack of communication. For what? To fry them and cook them? Give me a time. Oh, man. Things got so bad that both Jared. The chicken is raw. Jared, get out! I can't rely on Frank for shit. And Manda. Who's cooking the French toast? I was supposed to watch it. Get out! Are you fucking kidding me? We're sent back to the dorms. After a truly disappointing service on both sides, the blue team didn't hesitate to blame their loss on Frank's lack of teamwork. Frank, I had no support from you. None. Tough fucking shit then. Well, fuck you, buddy. And when Chef Ramsay asked, who should leave the blue team? He remained target number one. Frank. Frank. Frank, Chef. The red team's choice was also unanimous. Chad, 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 Chef. In the end, Chef Ramsay eliminated an early favorite. Chad. Ending his dream of becoming the head chef at BLT Steak in Bally's Las Vegas. And now, the continuation of Hell's Kitchen. Like, get out of it. This is really aggravating because you got fucking people that want to smile in my face and then say my name a half hour later. It's not fair. How does it feel? To be a target? My thing is, like, yo, you're gonna put me up because I'm doing better than you? Just keep doing what you do, and soon you won't have to worry about them. It's just unfortunate that I have to work with backstabbers. I used to bartend. I know, I bet you did. I did. <laughs> did you make a lot of money from lesbians? I'm sure lesbians loved you. Oh, lesbians love me. I've never met a lesbian who did not want to fuck me. I don't, no offense. Yeah, you do. It's a fact. Ashley's not gay, she's bisexual. And girls are always obsessed with me. I'm offended by that. You're just not my type. It's no offense, you're just not my type at all. I'm, I'm everybody's lesbian type. I would not bang Jackie if she was the last person to bang on this earth. I would fuck Kristen. <laughs> Kristen? <laughs> I know you're full of shit now. <laughs> Jackie, I'm serious. I am I would not. She is full of crap. I am like a lesbian and bisexual magnet. She is so I'm offended. I'm so offended. I said I would never sleep with her. Every lesbian and bisexual girl wants me. Apparently not. Well, she's the only one, and that's shocking, and I'm sad, and I'm offended. <laughs> what about Jared? Totally. Look at his face. How could you fuck Jared and not me? How is that even possible? Sorry, Jackie, but this ain't happening. I'm like super fucking offended. Let's go, guys. 
in front of you, there are three trays of amazing proteins. Sea bass, rack of lamb, and then chicken breast. I want you to come up with three stunning dishes. You can only use the ingredients that you collect and place on those trays with that protein. I'm going to give you five minutes to gather your ingredients. Clear? Yes, yes chef. chef. Your five minutes starts now. OK, right, guys. guys, let's start with the sea bass. Sea bass, let's keep it light. Let's keep it fresh. Orzo with the sea bass. Orzo with the sea bass or rice. Yeah. Herb crusted, rack of lamb. I love it. What else do we put in the couscous? Um, Jackie's not making any suggestions. She's kind of just like letting us run everything. I say we go with mushrooms. And we're going to like rub it, right? And then, yeah. then banter oh, it. Yeah. OK, just making sure. I think of uh, mushroom and uh, potato hash. Mushrooms and chicken, marsala wine is perfect. I got a challenge with the same people that just were trying to stab me in the back. I fucking hate all three of them, but I have to work with them now. All right, I got the Dijon. Yeah. Five. Okay. Put the remesco Four. on there. For a sauce for chicken. Two. Crispy leeks. One. Right. Time's up. Yeah. You are now living with what's on your trays. Waiters, come on out. Oh shit, what's about to happen? Thank you. You will have 40 minutes to nail those three stunning dishes, but there'll only be one person from your team in the kitchen at a time. I knew it. I knew it. Chef Ramsay always has something up his sleeve. Every five minutes, one chef will exit, and a new chef will enter. It is critical that you communicate and coordinate with each other. Everybody. Come and stand behind the velvet ropes. Let's go. So you're going to go first. You want me to go first? Yeah. We want Jackie to go first because anything that Jackie fucks up, then there's three of us to fix it. Jackie, Jared, are you ready? Yes, yes chef. chef. Your time starts now. Go, Jackie. Come on, Jer. In today's communication relay challenge, each team is responsible for three entrees featuring sea bass, chicken, and rack of lamb. That rack of lamb needs to get prepped immediately. Chefs will cook in five-minute shifts, with each team member going twice, for a total of 40 minutes cooking time. Get some pants on, get some cream for the purees. Hurry, hurry. It's crucial that the first chef on each team lay down a good foundation for the chefs that follow to build upon. Jackie, remember, we're searing that, so don't go too thick on the Dijon, all right? Hurry. Salt, pepper, Jackie, salt, pepper. Got it. All right, you're not that stupid. Honey, Jackie is the weakest chef on the red team. Jackie, make sure you get that chicken going, too. Yes. Two and a half minutes to go. Jared, what are you working on right now? Sancho? I'm starting I'm starting the puree. Awesome. Oh, got it. I feel like I am the strongest on my team, so I decide to go first. I can get, you know, things started and make sure everything's set up. Vitamix will be ready for the puree. Oh, got it. Switch. Come on, Frank. Go Ashley, go Ashley. Okay. The departing chefs have just 15 seconds to communicate with their incoming teammates. All right, that's already pan seared. I put, put the butter in. All right. And that's it. That's all I did. <sighs> Puree's on the other side. Where's the rice? Out. It's up here, friend. Let's go. Out. Oh, no. The Dijon's burnt. Thanks, Jackie. We are screwed. Take it out of the pan and wipe that shit off with your rag. Heard. Break, break, you're boiling over. You're boiling, you're boiling over. If the puree is burnt, this could destroy our challenge. Frank, make sure the bottom of that pan isn't scorched. No, inside. Switch. Go. Let's go, Ariel. OK, What's look. Up? Lamb's right there. Got it. We got the puree going right there. I have the couscous going. Here's your lamb sauce. Your lamb is in the oven. Oh. It's a lot harder than it looks. Yeah. It's like you, you think you have time for something. You, you don't. Need. You have no time. All right, Danny, let that sear hard. No problem. Pancetta, I'm working on right now. Heard. Awesome. This is working. That's working. Let me get the fettle in the pan. Last 60 seconds. Last 60 seconds, heard. I'm putting the carrots in cold water, guys. Heard. Get ready. Switch. Let's go. I need just one open. I need you Hurt. to glaze that pan. Paper sauce tastes good. I would do some veg sauce just to take down the saltiness. Hurt. That is straight in cold water, but oh. that's more fire. Hurt. Hurt. Come on, Kristen. Pulling out the carrots, all right? They're good? You need to pan sear them. Kristen, make sure the carrots are cooked, so all we're doing is glazing them. They're, they're all done right now. They're going to be mushy if you do anything else with them. Ariel, just like, relax. It's not hard to cook baby carrots. Two minutes okay. to go. Tr mushrooms are going with what? With the potatoes. Yes, it's the hash. 
Oh my God. Come on, Amanda. I'm a mom. I juggle three kids every single day, but cooking three different dishes, the fuck is this? Is insane. Uh, switch. Each chef has one more five minute period to work on their team's three dishes, which must all be cooked and plated by the end of the final round. Chicken's in the oven, Yeah. okay? You have okay. to get the sun trail clean. You need to drop that sea bass. Out, let's go. Jared, are you gonna sear it now? Yeah, I'm searing bass. Hard. Hard. Drop in the sea bass. Hey, Jackie, what are you doing? Don't drop that fish. What? That's a five minute fish. Sea bass? Yeah. Five? Yeah. No, honey. It's so frustrating. We have got to drop that sea bass now. Do the fish or no? You need to drop that fish, Jackie. Yes. Good, good, good girl. Switch. Let's go, Frank. Talk to me. Go check the lamb. Take those mushrooms out of that pan, okay? That pan's burning. Out. Keep an eye on that orzo, all right? Out. Nice job, Jared. Ash, talk to us. You need any troubleshooting or you're good? No, I got it. Go, 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 go. Going for the lamb. Perfect. Beautiful, Frank. Nice and sexy. Thank you. Oh, the leaks. Oh, the leaks. Just under 60 seconds to go. See that's it. What's up with the sunchos? It's difficult to start where somebody else left off. I have proteins to my left. In front of me, there's four pans of veg. This is probably the hardest challenge we've had. Ugh, this is fucking murder right now. Switch. Come on, Danny. Hey, Danny, lamb's in the oven right now. We got a five minute timer on that. Got it. That's all we have for Sunshine? Three, That's all we have. Two, watch one, it. We gotta watch out. it. Good job, Ashley. Good job, Ash. I tried. Crush the Dijon on the lamb. I didn't get hurt, a chance hurt, to do hurt. it. You guys trust me? Can you just. I trust you, I baby. Trust you. I trust you. I know shit needs to happen. There's no room for error. I have to try to set Kristen up with her mise en place so she can focus on plating. Orzo is going with the... Orzo's going with the sea bag. All right, got you, got you, got you. Danny, yes. remember that breadcrumbs toast up fast, all right? There was a five minute timer on there. Five minute for what? Danny, check hey, that that's lamb. That's gonna be way too long. Danny, check that lamb. Got it. This is where it counts. This is so intense, it's not even funny. Switch. Come on, Amanda. It's the final leg of this intensive test of teamwork, creativity, and communication. The lamb is pressing. You got some leaks right here. And with just five minutes left on the clock, it's up to Kristen and Amanda to complete the cooking and plate all three of their team's dishes. Out. This is it. All right, get the plate set up on the path and then do everything else. Kristen, put a little oh, bit on. of a I'm fucking thinking. This is pure adrenaline right now. I got to glaze these carrots, all right? It's really hard because there's shit everywhere. Where is the fucking butter? Ay, Dios mío, I'm gonna have a heart attack. 30 seconds to go. Where is everything? Why everything's sitting right in front of you? Go, Chris, get go, 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 go. Quick, quick, quick. quick. Uh, chicken. Get that chicken. Make it happen. Five, four, Come on, Chris, three, man. two, go, 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 one. Go. Stop. Go. Good job. Well done. Chefs, back in the kitchen, please. Let's go. Chef Ramsey will now judge the dishes head to head, giving one point to the team who has created the best dish for each of the three proteins. Let's start off with the battle of the sea bass. Bring them down, please. I'm worried about this fish being overcooked. Ashley told Jackie to drop the fish about two minutes too early. Ariel, tell me about the sea bass, please. All right, so we have a pan seared sea bass with fennel fronds, tomato, and purple spinach. Wow. Sea bass is cooked beautifully. It's glistening and it's got a lovely sear on there. Uh, beautifully done. Hell yeah, red team. We got this shit. Frank, describe the bass, please. A pan seared sea bass topped with some blood orange and some rice with stock, salt, and pepper. It's glistening, it's moist. Tough on this one. Point goes to red team. Yes, thank you, chef. And the booty. Oh, Good job. Yes. Cha ching. Next up, battle of the lamb. I'm not feeling too great. I'm hoping Ashley scraped all the burnt mustard off. Kristen. We did a pan-seared lamb, just salt and pepper. We brushed it with Dijon and uh, roasted cauliflower. Still pink inside, nice. Mm. Everybody good indeed. Thank you, Thank you, Chef. Amanda. We have a panko and herb crusted rack of lamb. Mm. Seasoned beautifully. Tough on this one. But there is one lamb dish that has the edge because it's been cooked better. Uh, congratulations. Red team, good job. Thank you, Thank you chef. chef. Yes. I saved the lamb. Two to one red. Uh, let's go. Slide down the chicken, please. 
the blue team, their chicken looked like an anemic dietary supplement plate. Like, it was terrible. Yeah. What we have is a pan-seared chicken breast with a fingerling potato hash with wild mushrooms laced throughout it. And there's also pancetta in the hash as well. Mm. For me, the chicken is cooked beautifully, seasoned nicely. But it feels like there's something missing on the dish. Ashley. What we have for you is a pan-roasted chicken breast with a wild mushroom sauce and uh, sauteed baby carrots and purple cauliflower. Um, ugh. Carrots are raw. What a shame. Point goes to Blue Team. Well done. Chef. Good job. Good job, guys. I'm beyond furious. Honestly, had Kristen listen to me with the carrots. Make sure the carrots are cooked, so all we're doing is glazing them. They're, they're all done right now. They're going to be mushy if you do anything else with them. I think we would have won the chicken dish hands down. Uh, red Team, Blue Team, we have a tie. So I'm going to go back to the original dishes, the sea bass, and pick out the best dish. One fish has the edge. Congratulations. Blue team, well done. Good job. You just open this up and look, it flakes beautifully. Literally flakes. Total perfection on cooking fish. Well done. We did awesome. That gorgeous sea bass, it was beautiful. I wanted it. Blue team, I want you to fully enjoy this incredible reward. In fact, Gerard, you'll like this because I would like to wager. Uh oh. <laughs> I am a gambling dosh. man, Chef. I want you to take care of that bundle of <laughs> hundreds <laughs> because all of you are going to be spending a VIP day at the track at the famous Santa Anita Park. Oh, yes! I'm so excited to go to the horse track. I could really use the cash when I go home. I kind of owe my brother a grand. Oh, yes. I love it. Uh, Blue team, good job. Congratulations. Yes, well done. I'm so excited right now. For our next dinner service, we'll be featuring an amazing braised lamb shank dish. We have two full lambs arriving. Please be careful, because each lamb weighs close to 100 pounds. Get out of here. Thank you, Chef. Oh, this is not going to be fun at all. Should we oh, open the truck? Like, oh, oh, my God. Just get the legs. Let's go, bro. I think we lost the challenge because Kristen decided that the carrots were cooked rather than tasting them. <laughs> Got it? Yep. I don't like to think or feel that like I'm better than anybody here, but everyone on my team is lazy, slow motherfuckers. Ugh. My finger is in this thing's butt. Oh, wow. Make sure you don't get the blue team dirty. They look nice. They, they're going on a reward. Danny looks like she's ready to go to church on Sunday with a big flower in her damn hair. Congratulations, guys. Thank you. Lord, Lord, feel the Lord. Gonna see some horses. Danny ain't going no race track. That girl going to church. Hallelujah. Oh my god. Time to gamble. Look, blue team, welcome to San Anita. Oh, wow. Oh, this is amazing. God. I'm so excited. I love anything I can bet on. Me and my best friend growing up used to bet on what time his mom would pick us up to the minute. I knew we were going to be close to the track, but yeah. goodness, this is awesome. God, I have food, I have champagne, I have caviar, so I have bourbon. Beautiful. It's not getting better than this right now. You could drink that. I don't want it. Frank's got one drink and one drink only. I know that can real. Frank was being a little bit of a party pooper. I don't know what his deal was. From the great line that you like. Uh, oh, Frankie! Uh, uh, no, Frank gets like VIP treatment everywhere he goes. Happy now? <laughs> yeah, ecstatic. You don't want to have a good time? You want to be a brat? Stay home. Do some dishes. The people on my team, they are scumbags. They're trying to get rid of me because I'm the threat. One person, in your mind, who should leave the blue team? Frank Chef. Frank Chef. Frank. If you think for one second that I'm going to fucking smile and be f just as fake as them, I'm not stooping down to their level. First race is coming up. I want to place a bet. I want to place a bet. It's just like chopping wood. Oh, man, this dude is bright. Hold on. Just wait. Put the fucking saw down. You don't even know Shut what you're doing. Up. Yeah, I'm going to cut the arm off. 
I don't know who thinks it's a good idea to keep giving Jackie weapons. You can probably, no, stop, why? Look, Jackie, don't do that. Turn it. You got to like grab it from both sides and like literally saw like this as if you were cutting down a damn tree. Yeah, Jackie? Yeah? Yeah? I don't know. I'm not a carpenter. Whoop <laughs> Did it. The horses for the thirds are now coming out on the track for the Hell's Kitchen Derby. Woo! Yeah! We have an entire race named after us. I mean, who gets this? Are they moving into the gate? We do. Woo! Woo! We go! By the lead! Number two. Lead. Number two, baby. Oh, one, 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 one. Let's go, baby. Let's go! Oh, brother. Oh, three, yes, three, yes, that's five. Following a closely contested challenge the day before, both teams prepare for tonight's dinner service. I'm gonna go get six pans and nine pans. Heard. And looking to rebound from yesterday's loss, the red team is hoping to sharpen their communication and teamwork by doing a mock service before the doors open. About three and a half out on this risotto. Steak's going in the oven. I never put my steak in the oven. I usually put my steak in the oven. Really? I'm the only one that successfully worked the meat station thus far, so just listen to me. This could use a little bit more. Did you go in the oven with this? No. Okay. I didn't run to the side. She went in the oven with it. So we'll start new. Pull open that steak so you can temper yeah. it. Her... Ariel is just like a toddler, and she wants to find something to fuck with me. I don't even know what the problem is, Ariel. You just want to like explain to me why you're pissed off? First of all, you lied to Chef about the steak because you did put it in I the oven. I didn't fucking lie to Chef about the steak. I said I put it in the oven for like two, three minutes. No, she said, did you put it in it's the oven? It's not your and fucking you're... business. You know what? Here you go. This is what we do with my nieces when they want to fight. Come on. I'm going to lock you in your room for a minute, and you guys can work it out. Go ahead. So nobody else has to be worried about it. Work it out. You asked me what the issue was, I, I know, told I you. Why are you talking? Let me I'm... fucking talk then, because you don't know what the issue is. Your steak wasn't cooked properly, and you lied to Chef. It was a practice for a reason. You don't need to sit there and be like, you fucking lied to Chef. You fucking did this. Stay the fuck out of you're it. Really All you're doing is you're... fucking sticking your nose where it doesn't no, belong. It, I listen when I talk. Done with and this And when I say, like, oh, I'm You understand it, why I don't listen I'm when you talk? This, even when I'm talking, Chris. All right, this say, is stupid. And I say, I'm doing this. Okay, I'm done. I'm done with this conversation. You already know that we have agitation. Why would you be disrespectful? Plain and simple, bro. I'm sick and tired of trying to be diplomatic, just like I have to deal with you being a fake fucking pussy ass bitch. You have to deal with me being a crazy ass aggressive bitch. We still have to work together. We have to figure it out. Well, I'm done. That's what's plain and simple. I'm done talking to you. So how do we all feel like going into service? Like questions, comments, concerns? Yeah, am I gonna be thrown under the bus again like that? Um, well, I'm gonna hit you with this cutting board oh, before man. I do it. Frank, is, is that what you've been bothered about all day? Frank, just chill out. This whole situation, I'm totally over. I'm just totally fucking over. What's the problem? Frank, you, Frank, what's the problem? You you Frank thinks it's know. a popularity no, no, contest no, no, right now. No, no, but what's honestly, I gotta be on the team with them three and like, Them no. three. Okay, don't isolate yourself. See the animosity well, okay, right here? Okay, okay. What's, what's the problem? It's personal because like, the way I am, like my attitude and who I am is, you know, Frank, you know, it's basically why I went up for elimination. Is that what you're upset about? Because you got put up there one time and you're still here today? What's the point? Uh, what's the point then? Not the point. You were, no, 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 I'm just, I'm asking. Step over here and tell me what the point is then. What's the point? So you went up for elimination, big fucking deal. You stood in front of one of the most highly decorated chefs and said, why? Let it be personal for them. Don't let it be personal for you. If they want to play that game, let them play that game. You just have to work together. You know how often I know people are gunning, gunning for my fucking job? Do I take it personally? I don't even look over my shoulder. You know yeah. what I do? I do my job and I do it well. Chef Christine is right. Just be a beast on the kitchen. If they don't like it, it hurts their feelings, too bad. Because it's Chef Ramsey's word, not their fucking word. Ladies, good afternoon. Good afternoon, good afternoon Chef. Good afternoon, Chef. Now, let's go. Uh, blue team, you ready? Yes, yes, chef. yes, Chef. You've heard the expression before, too many cooks, right? Yes, yes chef. chef. That's not the case tonight, Jared, is it? No, Chef. No, Chef. Mourinho. See, si, Chef. Open Hell's Kitchen, please. Awesome. Let's go. There you go.
Hell's Kitchen is open, and a steady stream of hungry diners are arriving, eager to get a taste of Chef Ramsay's famous menu. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Well, isn't it gorgeous? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna go with uh, the scallops. All right, tickets are about to come in, guys. Let's get this fired up. Oh, no, here we go, ladies. Good luck, yeah? Communication, right? Yes, yes chef. chef. Four cups table 41. Two results of two scallops. Yes, chef. yes, Chef. Let's go. Ash, talk to me, all right? In about five minutes. I am a chef at my family-owned restaurant, but I have to prove that I can do things on my own without them holding my hand. There we go. Work for me, baby. Lobster tail's going to the pass, Ashley. Walking with risotto. Yeah. Right, all of you, come here. Hop. Yeah, quickly. What does that look like? Soup, chef. It's too not thin. It's, it's too thin, chef. It's too loose, chef. Fucking soup. I mean, come on. <laughs> fucking hell. It looked like Ashley was like, and just fucking snotting risotto everywhere. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, now you finish it off, and add a touch of that back to it, Chef. and correct the seasoning. Come on, please, Ashley. Yep. Let's go. Come on, you with me now? Yes, Chef. Yeah? Yes. That's your one for the night. Four cover table 22. Two risotto, two scallop. Yes, yes Chef. Chef. Seven minutes out on that risotto. Two risotto, correct? Frank has no concept of teamwork whatsoever. But I kind of thought that when you were a Marine, you had to rely on each other. Two risotto, correct? Two risottos, Frank, right? Frank, two risotto? I hear crickets. How long in that risotto? Can I walk with lobster tail yet? Chef, risotto right here, chef. Come on, the lobster. Hey, where's the lobster at? There you go. right here. All right, let's go, bring it up. Are we doing this already? Because I'm not playing this game tonight. Lobster behind. Go. Go, go, go. As the blue team pulls together and delivers on their first ticket. OK, this risotto mm -hmm. was worth waiting for. Up to the Over in the red kitchen. On order, two cups of table 34, two risotto, two carbonara. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ashley's working hard to not repeat her earlier mistake of delivering soupy risotto. Oh my God, what's happening? Just stir it, stir it, stir it so you get that moving more. Risotto. 30 seconds, please. Come on, red team. All right, come on, guys. What the fuck is that? Huh? It's like a fucking cheese fondue. Hey, hey, all of you. Yeah, that, that's you as well. All of you, come here. Let me just show you something. Just look at this. Look at this. I swear to God, there's more fucking cheese in there than there is in fucking Holland. Ashley, come here. Are you okay? I apologize. No, but are you are, are you okay? What is it? You've checked out, right? I want a risotto, and yes, I want chef. it quickly. Yes, chef. Got it. I need three and a half on these two risottos. What else do you need, Ashley? I need those two carbonaras started. Two carbonaras, two in there, yeah. Heard. Ashley is fucking up her risotto, so. Carbonaras in the water. Things are coming in fast. We gotta move. We gotta move now. Don't you guys leave Ashley hanging here. I'm working her carbonara, chef. Stay with her. You push with her. 30 seconds. 30 seconds, heard. Let's get Ashley out. Walking with risotto. Carbonara. I'll do the risotto. I'm looking at him with fear of God in me, because I know if it's bad, I'm fucking screwed. Good go. You know where you're going, yes? Much to Ashley's relief, Chef Ramsay has sent her refired risotto out to the dining room. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Six top, two Arctic char, two lamp, two New York strip. Yes, Chef. Oh, yes. I got two char jobs. I need five minutes. Yes, five, five minutes. Five minutes, hurry. All right, I'm going to watch the spinach. I'm going to keep having better services. I'm going to be louder, and I'm going to run faster. I'm going to go hard. Jerry, you good over there, bro? I'm all right right now, yeah. OK. Amanda, how you looking? Uh, I'm OK. OK. Danny. Yes. How you looking over there? I'm doing OK right now. OK, good. Hey, what do you need right here? What do you need right here? Frank, just uh, you want me to watch this? Check that. OK. Get, get some snapper garnish going, actually. Heard. Walking with steaks. Heard. Heard. Garnish walking. Yes, yes. garnish perfect. Chuck walking. Behind. Service, please. Yes. Hey, blue team, great timing, great communication. Keep it going, man. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Yeah, we're motivated, baby. We're motivated. Blue team, you know, just hop on my fucking back because I'm driving this motherfucker. While the blue team pushes out entrees to hungry diners. Wow, that is amazing. 
over in the red kitchen. Entree to Artie Char to Wellington to New York Strip. Yes, yes chef. Yes, chef. Let's go. All right, Chris, and our next fire is all us. All right. All right, you're ready to go? Give me five minutes total to meet you at the window. OK. Kristen and I don't get along that well. But at the same time, no matter how much Kristen and I don't like each other, we work very well in service. Did you see any Wellington up there, Ariel? Give me one second. Let me get this garnish again. I'll look. No problem. Just double check next time you go up. All right. Sometimes, like, you work better in a kitchen with people you don't get along with. Kristen, you're ready with your welly? I'm ready with both my meats. All right, I got your garnish for that welly, babe. What are we going with first, guys? What do you want to go with, char? Ariel, give me a poke. Just give me a poke. They feel tight, but I think you're good. Walking chef. Working chef. Nicely cooked. Thank you, chef. I mean, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I can hate Ariel at 9 a.m., but at the end of service, I want to hug the bitch because she pushed us through service, you know? Despite their differences, Kristen and Ariel's teamwork is propelling the red team forward. Two Arctic Char, two New York strips right after, yes? Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Go with lamb? Yes, walking with lamb. I'm walking with strips. Walk in with two Arctic Chars. And both teams are delivering entrees at an impressive clip. Fantastic. Red team, come here, quickly, let's go. Hey, blue team, come here, let's go. All of you, quick, let's go. This has been one of the best services so far. Both kitchens, last table. Yes, chef. First yes, to finish wins. Yes, chef. Let's go. Let's go, 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 go. Go, 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 let's do it. Everybody's running, everybody's rushing. We like cocaine addicts, OK? Let's go, oh, let's go. Guys. This is exactly like the horse races the day before. This is all out, balls to the wall. Let's push as hard as we can. We cannot afford to lose. Two minutes to the window, can we speed that up? I got this. Guys, I need another two minutes on that Arctic Char. Garnish for the Arctic Char is going up right now. As soon as you have garnish, I can slice these wellies right here, Jared. Walking with welly garnish. Walking Walk with welly. Walking slicing wellies right now. Take the pan and go, 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 go. Garnish is in the window. Heard. Char, how long? About 45 seconds. 45 seconds to the window. Let's go. You don't think that's good? Amanda, where you at? Char's not done. Look them back over and keep them high. Walking with wellies to the window. You think it's cooked? I'll take it off right now. Guys, look, I think she can do it. You guys think this is cooked? Check them. Oh, we're good, we're good. Go, go, yes, go. Guys, look, I think she can do it. You guys think this is cooked? You guys push hard. Behind, corner. Yes, go, Red Team. Let's roll. Red Team, Archie Charles, roll in the middle. Yeah. No, 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 back on, Chef. Back on, Chef. Roll. Back on. Face it, face it, face it, face it. And Angie came by, touched it, and goes, oh, no, it's good. Send it. Bring it up, because Angie's an idiot. Fuck them wrong. Well done. Good. Blue team. Yes, Chef. Congratulations. Well done. Thank you, Chef. Thank you, Lord. I knew that fucking shit was wrong. But you're worried about that Arctic char, and you didn't even have the sauce season or in a gravy boat, so relax. Did that water bottle just go in the trash? This isn't your bedroom. You don't get to just throw shit around because you're having a temper tantrum. Pull yourself together. Be professional. Red team. Yes, yeah, chef. Just line up there. It's fine. What a shame. Overall, it was a pretty good service. Uh, unfortunately, you lost. All of you. Uh, head up to the dorm. I need two nominees. Yes, yeah, chef. Yes, yeah? chef. Yeah, Let's go. Two seconds, yeah, you. What's wrong? I'm better than that. We may have had an awkward night, but don't get down about it. Get strong and get vocal. The chef. Get out of here. I'm pissed off because I'm so much better than that. You know, I'm a threat to them in the end, so of course they're going to want to get me out. Now they have their chance. Oh, I'm so mad. I, I just want to say I think everybody did did well tonight. It doesn't matter. I'm the one that fucked us over. I'm the one who told Jackie to send the fish. So yeah, it's my fault we lost. That's why we lost. I mean, that sucked. So I nominate Ashley, I nominate Jackie. You want to nominate me. You need to relax when you're throwing your water bottle around. I knew I shouldn't have fucking sent up that fuck because I was pissed that we lost. If we would have fucking won, we wouldn't be here right now. Sure, but you understand? I'm sorry if I'm passionate. I got pissed the fuck off that we lost. You're so defensive, Jackie. Fucking relax, bro. You know what it is? I just feel like I'm being attacked, and I feel like I did nothing wrong today. And you still vote for me. I don't want to attack you. Who else are we going to vote for, Jackie? It's more than just your cooking. It's, it's how you professionally act. We all get pissed off, but you need to just contain it a little bit more. We all were pissed off that we lost. 
God, man, I'm, I'm so sick and tired of people telling me how I need to change the way I do things. Oh my God, oh my God. You're a bitch and you want to give me a speech on how my personality sucks? It should be Kristen and Ashley. I shouldn't even have been a conversation in this. I vote me and Kristen. You and I? Yeah, I vote, yeah, I vote you and Kristen. Why am I nominated? You need to say something. Well, I'm, I don't know who else to nominate. Are you serious? I don't get it. I don't deserve to be up for elimination. This is a, a mind fuck. Please talk. I don't know what you want me to say. I want you to say, say why you want me to be voted for. Don't put my name up there, because I did the best I could to help you. Don't put my name in there because you can't think of something else. We need to make a decision. This is like, I'm getting a fucking headache. Red team, have you reached a decision? Yes, yes chef. chef. Ariel, red team's first nominee and why? Chef, tonight our first nominee was Ashley. Ashley? Yes. Obviously a difficult decision, but we all agreed that she could have communicated a little bit more. Second nominee. Chef, um... Name, one word. Jackie. Why? I think there was too much focus on, like, we have to win, we have to win, when really the focus still should be, we have to rush, but you also have to produce a good product. OK, Ashley, Jackie, step forward, please. Ashley. Yes, Chef. What happened? I just got inside my own head, but it will never happen again, ever. So what makes you a better chef than Jackie? I can run a restaurant. I run a restaurant back home. That's I know the business for your side. Dad's. Yes, for my dad's. Having parents that own restaurants doesn't necessarily make you qualify to be a success in this industry. This is what I've wanted to do since as long as I can remember. And I would have done it with or without them, 100%. I know that. I didn't feel that tonight. Jackie. Yes, Chef. What happened with the raw fish? Um, at that point, I had said, it still needs more time. And Ashley had said, they're done, send them out. I knew they were not done. So why bring them to me? I, I, I made a mistake, Chef. Are you not confident in yourself? I, I am confident, Chef, but I was trusting Ashley, and I shouldn't have done that. This is tough. My decision is, Ashley. Back in line. Young lady, come here, please. Uh, yeah, chef. Let me tell you something. Yes, you've shown so much improvement, but you are not ready to become the next head chef at BLT. Thank you, chef. I appreciate everything. Thank you. I really Good do. luck. Thank you. Bye, guys. Bye, Jackie. Bye. I'm standing here not on my cooking ability at all, but on how I get mad. They feel like I'm not professional. And maybe they're just intimidated. I mean, maybe they thought I was going to kill them all. I don't fucking know. Uh, all of you, mistakes will happen. But it's how you handle those mistakes, and it's getting yourself out of that situation that intrigues me more now. Is that clear? Yes, yes chef. chef. Well done. Get out of here. Fuck yeah. The Jackie show is over. Finally, we have the jester out of the court. Deuces. Oh my god. <sighs> this has been a serious wake-up call. It sucks because I'm so much better than that shit. I can do things on my own without my dad's. I'm not going to get kicked out that easily. Jackie was one of the most outspoken chefs in the history of Hell's Kitchen. It's just a shame her mouth was bigger than her talent.
everyone knows, the fires of Hell's Kitchen only burn hotter at night. Oh, God. After nearly being torn apart, I thought I was gone. I did. Will fate finally bring these two star-crossed chefs together? You've been the only person there since day one. You have. <laughs> like, what is that? This isn't a soap opera. And then. Hey, for now on, just don't touch the snapper until I look at it, please. Will one chef's sinister plot. I'm over Frank. To destroy her mortal enemy. We're about to get fucked up. Frank, enough with the attitude. Frank, young man, would you like to go home? Leave him clinging for his survival. That's it, blue team. No, 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 it's all next time. The snakes. On a double crossing episode. Scumbags. Of Hell's Kitchen. <laughs>